What is up you guys, AFK back here with another tutorial in the lovely AFK land super flat sea that we have been working on for quite a while now. And uh, well, today we're actually doing a new house in this world, because I want a house right here. It was just nothing here, and the grass was already gone, so it's just like a house. So if you're wondering, it's a 9x9 nine nine, uh, frame, it's a 9x9 nine nine house, it's going to be really small, because I don't want to make a big house, because we have our big little villa right there and I didn't want to mess up anything over there so what you're gonna need you're going to need white wool you're going to need some clay some um, ice some glass some paint and some birch wood and probably some let's get some stone slabs and maybe just maybe I'm feeling it some birch wood stairs just in case so let's go ahead and get started with this build. Are you all ready for the first block to be placed? I know I am. You're going to come right here from the second block and you're going to place down your white wool just like that. Just like that. Now, what you want to do is you want to count from that block. You're going to count one, two, three, and then curve it just like that. And that is it. I'm just kidding. That's not it. And you're going to skip over one. You're going to count one, two, three. You're going to do the same one, two, three. Now, our entrance is actually going to be right here. And we're going to dig down because it's actually going to go into the ground, just like that. And we're going to go ahead and just make this look a little cool. Now, here is actually going to go upstairs. So, we're going to go ahead and make that an upstairs area, just in case. Just to change it up a little bit. So now that we have that, you want to go ahead and, where's our ice? I think I passed it. There it is. Well, actually, you're going to get your white wool, and you go up one, two on each. So one, two, and then one, two. And you're going to get your ice, and you're just going to fill in the ice. Not right there. That's the entrance. So just right here. And you're just going to get your stone slabs, and you're just going to slap it up right there. So this is going to be the front of your house. It's a small build, mainly meant for one or two people to live in, not for a whole family of nieces and nephews to live in. Keep that in mind when you when you have friends over. Not a big not a big party house, if you know what I mean. So we're just gonna add our glass here to make this look a little fancy, because we actually are going to be down here, so we can keep it like that. So that's the first part. So now you want to go ahead and get your clay, and you just want to put your clay right here over everything just build it up make it look a little nice and then you want to get your steps just like this and you are actually going to go not there not there you want to go over it just like this and we're going to leave this one out so this is the front of your house just like that and we're going to make a corner piece here if it'll do it oh it is doing it what am i doing it'll do it there we go and we got a corner piece okay is the sun going down i don't even know where the sun is actually okay there it is the sun is going down i was like whoa so we're going to go ahead and we're going to get our glowstone and we're going to go ahead and light this place up a little bit so it doesn't looks too dark i'm just putting this on all the corners okay so now i'm going to be right back and go ahead and sleep. Alright guys, I'm back and let's keep conti yes, continue on our house. So, now that we have this basic frame, we're actually going to get our white wool and we're going to branch off here and then we're going to come here, just like this. But you're going to have this one here, you're going to skip one, have one here, skip one, have one here, and you're going to go up here and you're going to connect it there. So it does this kind of design. Like I said, it's a very small house. You can actually leave this one out and do something like this if you want to. I'm actually going to probably do that. So, now we're going to actually get our steps, and we're going to put our steps in between all of our little plank areas here, but we're going to leave this area here for some cool design. So, now that we have this here, we're actually going to get our birch wood. Where's our birch? Where's our lovely birch wood? And we're going to go ahead and fill this in, because this is going to be our second floor for, you know, people to live in and stuff. So now that we have that, we're going to actually do this on all the area that we have steps. And you're probably wondering why am I doing this? You probably already know why I'm doing this. But you know, it doesn't really matter. 
So you're gonna get your steps. You're gonna put an upsteps, upside down step like this on all the all the lovely corners here. And we have this one. I think is going this. Okay, it's right. And then you're gonna take these off. And you're gonna get your slabs, and you're going to do this kind of the design with the slabs over the steps and connect it to that. Doesn't that doesn't that just look nifty? I think it looks very nifty. So now you're gonna put your glass in between your little steps. I know it looks a little ratchet, but you know, we'll fix that. And you're gonna get regular glass and put between these just like this. See? It gives it kind of like a cool little domino effect. I, I like I like how it looks. Now here we're actually going to get our ice and we're going to make our ice connect there. And then right here thinking right here we should just go ahead and add another upside down step just to complete all our little gaps and let's just go ahead and wrap that around just like that okay that looks looks somewhat normal there we go okay so this is the entrance let's go ahead and carve out our little area here for our little wood and stuff like that let's go ahead and get our birch I really like the birch wood in this texture pack. It looks quite nice. And I forgot we're actually going down two. So this is going to be our floor. You have, you have a decent amount of space, actually. But, you know, this is a good survival house. If you're just with your friends and you're just like, hey, I don't feel like making a big, gigantic mansion and risk dying from a creeper, this is just something to build for fun. So we're just going to add all of our little... Let's just carve all this out. And just add this and get our birch wood go back to our wool get our birch wood wool wool and wood okay now here I'm actually thinking about leaving it just like this I'm not really sure what I want to do here but I might I might put it like a little room here or something so let's go ahead and take this out and we can just leave it like that. Let's just add our glass, uh, ice, ice as I meant. So we have our little room storage here. I need to bring you out. Okay, there we go. That's our little home on the inside. So let's work on the upstairs part of our house. The upstairs is actually done. We just have to do the roof design, which is actually my favorite part of the house. So with your wool, you're just going to build over just a little bit, you know, not too much to make it look a little bit decent. We're going to make it come out about right there. And then we are going to get our spruce. No, I don't really want spruce wood. Do I want spruce wood? No, I just want to keep our wool. We're going to go up one, two, three, and we're going to build across and match it up with this side. Now, you're just going to build all the way across our lovely little slab area here. And we're just going to connect it just like that and this will be the second floor now with the second floor keep in mind that you want some breathing room and we have three blocks but I'm gonna give us an extra half block and we're just gonna go over the roof with this half block of slabs ah sorry We're going to fill this in, and we have our roof. But I'm not done. I'm going to add a little section here. And let's add some glass. I like how it floats. I think the floating of glass looks quite ravishing, don't you think? I'm just going to add in our glass here. And let it float. And now we're going to get our steps. And actually, I'm going to take these out and make us a traditional stair step roof. Just right here. Or maybe on the side. And I'm going to wrap it all the way. No. No. No, I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it to there. So let's just connect these two just like this. And connect these two corner pieces just like that. And leave our house just like how it is. So this is pretty much our little home that we have built. So now let's work on some decorations. You're going to now get sand, you're going to get some sugar cane, and you're going to need a bucket of water. 
So now let's over here, let's go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now this is optional. You don't have to do this. I just like doing this. And you're just gonna add a water bucket. And let's just random it up with some sugar cane here. If I can get it to grow. Okay. So we random it up right there. And let's get some torches. Just to light this place up a little bit. Oh, we already have glowstone there. So we're going to go inside. And keep in mind there is ice around. So keep in mind where you put your torches. You don't want to put them too close to some ice. That's why I have glass. And let's add some torches up here. Oops, there we go. Add some torches there, there. Let's add one here and here. So that pretty much wraps up this modern day build. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little tutorial. You know, it's not a lot. It's not. It's not a lot. It's not nothing either. It's something you know you would build in survival. So make sure you leave a like, leave a comment, and I hope you guys enjoyed our little modern day survival build. See you guys later.